Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. Today's actually going to be a cleaning organization motivation type of video. So after I did my pantry clean out video, if you guys missed that, I'll link it up in the cards above and in the description box below. A company reached out to me and asked me if I would be interested in doing a video review of their new product that they have just launched. These are airtight food storage containers, as you can see in this picture. They wanted me to do a review and give my honest opinion of what I thought of them. But I had just cleaned out my pantry and put all this new stuff in there, so I really didn't need it for storing stuff in my pantry like pasta, cereal, and all of that stuff. But then I had the idea of using it in my spice cabinet. Now as you're about to see in a second, my spice cabinet is a hot mess, you guys. I keep a lot more than just spices in there, but you are going to see a video of the before in a second and you're going to be like, whoa, it is a hot mess in there. There's stuff spilling over. Every time you go to grab something, stuff falls all over the place. I've tried to organize it before, but nothing has been cutting it. But wait till you guys see the after because you are absolutely going to love it. It has been so functional for us. We've had it for like about a week already done and it has been so functional and so much easier to reach in there and grab stuff. So I will go over the specifics of the containers later on in the video, but for now let's get started because this thing is definitely a mess. Alright guys, so here is the before. I'm just going to go over a video, just a quick glimpse of everything in here. You can see I keep a lot more than spices. I have all these drink powders, I have our protein powder at the top, and then there's a two level. So down here is such a mess. Down there all the spices are spilling over everywhere. It is just crazy. So the first thing I'm going to do is just take every single thing off of the top layer. Um, I ended up taking everything off the top and bottom all at once and then kind of putting everything back. But I just wanted to start with the top layer by itself. And then what I'm going to do is just spray it down with this Method Wood for Good Daily Cleaner and use my Brillo Basics Reusable Wipes from Dollar Tree just to give it a wipe down. And it smells absolutely delicious. <laughs> This is a seven piece set with four different sizes. There's 64.9 ounce. This one is a 42.3 ounce. There's a smaller one that is a 28.2 ounce and a little tiny one that is 17.6 ounces. They also sent these labels with a marker already. So the first thing I'm gonna do is take our chocolate milk powder. Yes, I know that is a lot of chocolate milk powder. My boyfriend absolutely loves chocolate milk. So then I'm just gonna take the lid and you can see that it's an airtight seal. It is absolutely amazing. It is so sealed and it has that like rubber lining so it makes it super, super tight. So then I'm just going to fill up all of those and then go ahead and mark these labels. This one specifically is a flower, but I went ahead and fill out a label for all of the different containers. So this is all of them. I have powdered sugar, chocolate milk, and then I have a rice in this one, sugar in this one, coconut flour in this one, and then regular flour in this big one. And then this one is our protein powder. Typically we have more, which is why I put it in that really big one. But that is how they turned out and I was so excited. And when I put them all in the cabinet, this is exactly how they turned out. I am so happy with how this cabinet looks now. It is so functional, so efficient. So now I have my salts here. I have all my like crystal light and drink powders in these red Dollar Tree bins and I just think it looks so good and then on this side I have my sugar, my flour, my coconut flour, and my powdered sugar. So I have all those there and then right next to that I have the rice. So then on the bottom level you can see I just have all the spices laid out neatly. So this I have tea bags and then some cupcake liners. I have all my spices that I don't use all the time kind of right here.
Then I have my pink salt that I use a lot and my everything but the bagel seasoning blend from Trader Joe's that I absolutely love. And then in these little tiny brandless containers, I have some taco seasoning mix that I got from Trader Joe's. And then here we just have our peanut butter, our baking spray, and then back there we have vanilla and some um, flavored vanilla syrup. And then on this very end, we have our extras that, you know, the rice vinegar and the Worcestershire sauce that's not in the refrigerator. And then I have some cooking wines and balsamic vinegars all along the edge right here. All right, so here is kind of an overview of everything standing from the ground. So you can see everything and everything is in a certain place. So one of my favorite things that I did was these little seasoning racks from Holler. I just put those on the side of the cabinet and put my most used seasonings in them and the only ones that would really fit in there. But I am absolutely obsessed with how this turned out and I think it's going to make my seasonings so much more accessible and just save me a lot of space in the actual cabinet. Here I also have my uh, measuring cups and measuring spoons and I just have them on a command hook from the Dollar Tree just so that they are out of the way as well and really accessible for me if I need them to measure anything while I'm cooking. So I have the spoons and then here are my measuring cups. I'm obsessed with these measuring cups but they're from the Chip and Joanna Gaines collection at Target. Love them. $7.99. Best purchase I ever made. But here is how it all turned out. I'm literally, like I said, so in love with it. I think it's so awesome. And these containers are so high quality, you guys. They're going to keep everything so airtight and so fresh. So I will leave a link to these in the description box below. Make sure you check them out and let me know if you guys do end up purchasing them because I do not think you will regret it. It is a seven-piece set and it comes with the labels and the markers. So that is it for today's video. Thank you guys so much for watching. Let me know what you think down in the comments below and I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye, guys.